It is actually Christine Duba. My mistake. It, Christine is 26. She stands five foot three. She's 117 pounds. She's from Panama City, Florida. So, so a lot of these ladies, as we know, Amanda, have a background in gymnastics and dance. And this, well, sure enough, she competed in gymnastics, cross country, and track in high school. So. Christine was an all-around athlete. She has a BS in exercise science and an MS in sports management. Heck yeah, she does. Strength, smarts, Smart, beauty, beauty, baby got it all. All of it, the whole package. She's got a little of an attitude with the music, too. Yeah, I like this. You, yeah, are yeah. you a rock guy, Sean? Rocking out a little bit every now and then, hey, Amanda. Yeah, I can see, you know. The, <laughs> lights, loosen up the tie, man. <laughs> Here we go. Here's her gymnastics skills paying off. Right. And especially if you have gymnastics training, that is so much more you can add to these routines because it gives you the ability to add backflips. You can, you know, if someone doesn't have that training, then yeah, they're no, relying on just, you know, self-taught. It's and, vitally important, isn't it, to have... <laughs> But as you mentioned earlier, it's a combination of the gymnastics ability, but with this strength right here, that's oh my a strength gosh. move. But Sean, here's what I respect so, so, so much. Not about only all of the competitors on the Olympia stage, but let's take it a whole nother step up with fitness. These women are dieted down. Yeah. And they're, they're doing this. I know what I'm dieting. I'm on the couch in my jammies. They're flipping. That's awesome. I mean, I seriously diet, low body fat, no water, yeah. and they're still doing these incredible feats of strength, oh, these amazing. incredible precision moves. Yes. This is a great performance by Christine. She's, she's really, she's got that kind of all-American girl look, and she's playing That's in the hell. For Christine Duba. Well done, Christine. We've got Christine Duba. You just left the stage, but immediately you came over here to watch Tangi. I mean, this is emotional seeing someone that's been in this sport for so long make her final run. Yeah, see, emotional. Talk about what's going on in your mind right now watching that. I'm just. She's been my coach, and before I even started working with Tangi, um, you know, she's just such an incredible athlete, and I've followed her. And, um, you know, I just, I, I feel so lucky and thankful that I get to be here and experience her last um, Olympia with her. We're all, we're all watching her and cheering her on. And now let's see who else is going to be cheering on when they leave the stage. And then, of course, the entire score of both routine and physique will then come into play. So we're seeing the top, the top. 15, top 14 actually, competitors once again, but now we're seeing them in bikinis so the judges can assess their physique, right. their definition, their muscularity, their symmetry, proportion, shape, all of it. Because once again, Sean, it is overall package. Like we said, a bikini, overall package. You have your presentation, plus you have your physique. So these ladies have their routine, plus their physique. That's, it, it's why it makes it even that much harder to not only nail your routine, but to also nail your conditioning, nail your physique, nail the way you look in your swimsuit. And they're wearing more in the way, obviously, of jewelry, which they're not going to be wearing during the performance. Right. The earrings, the, the bangle bracelets, the, the whole thing. And if they, bangle bracelet, what are you, uh, fat? This I, is, I, like I, I'm taking a guess here. Yeah, I have no idea Bangles, what I'm that's awesome. Did I, did I fake the fun time for the judges to make the tough decisions? Would you like to be a judge making a tough decision, Sean? I, you know what? I will leave just... that to the professionals yeah. because I don't it's know how. It's, it's precision work. Yeah. I mean, they are just, these judges are so well trained. Right, it's a very exhausting place. training process. Every one of them Sandy. earned their okay. way to that table. Number... That's very interesting. Anna, Could we have two? another upset on our hands? That. I don't know. I don't know either, I Amanda. Don't know what's going on? This is Six. interesting. Ariel Kadar. And ten, Janine Tadeo. That's only four here. There are four in this call out. Okay. okay. Quarter turn to the right. Doing their quarter turns. Quarter turn to the right. Quarter turn to the right. Ostensibly, this could be placing six, seven, and eight, forward. and ninth. Right. Please, thank you very much. And, and step back to either side. 
For me, at least, this is the first time I've seen both divisions call out a top five as opposed to a top six. Have you noticed that? Interesting. You're right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Good.